Wa alaikum assalam. How's it going? What are you up to? Well, I drink a little bit of coffee. So you like coffee? Yeah, sometimes. How do you start your day? Um, well, a little bit of coffee. <laughs> but usually, um, my daughter wakes me up. Um, and then uh, make her breakfast, myself breakfast. And then uh, we go out to the park, have some fun, you know? Daddy daughter time, that's how it usually is in the morning for me. That's awesome. What do you do in your free time? Um, I like outdoor stuff. Hiking, uh, kayaking, fishing when it's not freezing cold outside, and um, biking actually. Wow, that's pretty cool. Where are you headed off to? Uh, I'm actually heading out to a photo shoot. I'm a little late. How's it going? Hello, you alright? Yeah, check out my, uh, my new bike. Yeah, you have a new bike. It's cool, huh? Good, good. Very nice. That's a scooter bike. Thanks. <laughs> good. Hey, guys. Hey, man. How are you? You good? Can you just take this off? Yeah, please. Alright. So, yeah, photo shoot, man. I have an album coming out. Can I get rid of these headphones? And it's called Mercy. Am I right, Pedro? Am I good, man? Okay, cool. Mercy is a cool title. What inspired that name? Uh, mercy, well, it's a central topic in Islam. And, uh, you know, Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was set as a mercy to mankind. In fact, mercy is mentioned in almost all of my songs on the album. Do I look towards the light or? You're good. Yeah. Which song on the album did you have a hard time writing? Uh, which song did I have a hard time writing? To be honest with you, the song Trust was a difficult song for me to write. Not because like it was technically difficult to write, but the topic itself was quite painful. And uh, I wrote it in one night. I don't do that very often. But uh, yeah, very proud of that one. You seem like a natural. Did you use the model? <laughs> no, definitely not. Not at all. Thanks. <laughs> what about games? Are you a gamer? Uh, well, I have my Nintendo Entertainment System. And I got my Super Nintendo. And I have my Game Boy. And they all you know, work perfectly fine. Should I put this collar up or? Look like a World War II pilot or something. Who was your favorite teacher? My favorite teacher, Mrs. Carpenter. My ninth grade uh, world history teacher. She is super awesome. I learned a lot from her. And um, stuff that I learned in her class, I still use till this day. What's your worst habit? My worst habit? Uh, probably uh, not getting enough sleep, sleeping late. Every night I tell myself, sleep early, sleep early. But I end up sleeping late happens every time I somehow manage to get by. People who sleep a lot, eat a lot. What's your favorite food? Favorite food? <sighs> Can't go wrong with pizza, can you? Pizza, maybe grilled chicken, yeah. What advice would you give to an upcoming artist? Advice for upcoming musician, artist, or whatever, I would say focus less on social media stuff. Likes, shares, subscribes, you know, we're into that culture now. I think it's quite harmful. Uh, and I would say focus more on your craft and your talent. Hey Roy, where the heck in the world are you? I am in Chinatown here in uh, London City. <laughs> I'm Chinatowning. <laughs> What's your favorite color? My favorite color? Where are you? Oh, you're here. Favorite color, I would say my favorite color is a tie between red and green, depending on my mood. Favorite beverage? Favorite beverage would be club soda. Anything with like sparkling water, uh, none of the sugary stuff, of course. Have you ever Googled yourself? Have I ever Googled myself? As a matter of fact, I'm Googling myself right now. Uh, but honestly, who, who hasn't Googled themselves, you know what I'm saying? Any great fan moments? Great fan moment. I would say any time that someone has come up to me and uh, told me how they connected with my music is always a special moment for me, to be honest, you know? What did you want to be when you were a child? At age five, believe it or not, I wanted to be a taxi cab driver. You know, take people around and, and that kind of stuff. What do you do on your days off? Days off. On my days off, I like to spend time with my family. Usually anything that has to do with uh, outdoor activities. I just can't get enough of that. What is one hobby that you plan on picking up? You know, I really like um, cameras. I like uh, filmmaking and uh, putting story to get stories together using video and stuff. So maybe I'll get into that, who knows. What makes you angry? What makes me angry? Um, 
Injustice makes me angry. When I see people being treated unfairly, that makes me pretty upset. First memory of life? First memory of life, is that what you asked? I think I was three years old and I was at the beach. Not a very uh, memorable moment, but uh, one that I remember, of course. When do you feel most creative? Wait, one second, I have to look up this place. Sorry, can you ask again? When do you feel most creative? I feel most creative smack dab in the middle of the night. Not a very convenient time to be uh, creative, but that's when the juices come to me. If you could change your name, what would it be? If I would have a different name? I'm sorry, man, I'm happy with my name. I'm so grateful that my parents gave me this name. Such a cool name, <laughs> Rod. It's awesome. What would you like to be remembered for? What would I like to be remembered for? I'd like to be remembered um, as someone who tried in a world that's quite messed up at times, as someone who tried to make it just a little bit better. Was there a time you were nervous before a concert? Are you kidding me? All the time. I'm always nervous before every concert, every performance. It's just how it is. Right now. Am I nervous now? It's not a performance, man. Not at all. You gonna miss us? I'm gonna miss you guys a lot. I had a great time, man. Thanks, Rick. Alright, assalamu alaikum. I'll see you inshallah. Assalamu alaikum. See ya.